Hi everyone, Comic Reviewer here, and this time reviewing on Grave of the Fireflies. Now, as you know, Grave of the Fireflies was based on a short book by Akiyuka Norskika, which was based on his own life story, and which was also made into an animated Ghibli film, directed by Isio Kakukta. Now, the premise of the film is about Setsuko, who is a young girl, and also Seta, who is the older brother, how they struggle and survive in World War II, and at the same time trying to look out for each other, be there together, and also survive in a world plague with hard times. Now, Seta is meant to be the older brother and the more responsible one, and Setsuko is basically a young kid who is basically stuck in a world of hard times. Now, also given the fact that they've also now have to live in a bomb shelter, which, which, which was pretty much suggested by their cruel and if not understandable aunt, who basically believes them to be what the lazy slugs, even though they're just kids, and really, they they just don't know what else to do. Keeping in mind that sentences were set in Kobe as well as Japan, we see people struggling to survive and people coming to terms on how to survive in a world with air raids, bombs, and everything else. Now, I actually did bought the film to see if it had the 2012 dub, but actually had the 1998 dub. And I think somewhere the 1998 dub still holds up, because you actually have Volora Katara voicing Sato and Setsuko's mother, also known for voicing Ash and in Pokemon, and also known for voicing Sailor Pluto in the Viz dub of Sailor Moon. Now, keep in mind we see Sata struggling to survive and trying to be there for Setsuko, and we come to the conclusion that, yeah, they're not going to survive long. But I think at the same time, it's meant to show us how, as a sibling, a parent in that, we struggle to help those in need, and sometimes it can be a bit difficult. Now, I do admit I would have liked to have seen for the opening to have Sato as an older man writing his memoirs, and then at the end of Grave of the Fireflies, having Setsuko's ghost wave to him and smile, and leaving the older Sato to break down and cry. Now, I think sometimes it does take on some heartwarming moments, like Setsuko and also Sato playing, and we also see them them still having that strong bond, even though it's a war out and they're struggling to survive. Now, I do admit somewhere it's a great film. There's been like an adaption for a live action one. There's actually been, and I actually do feature the candy tins, which had a kind of a like fruit tin with the little sweets, which was later also rebranded for uh, for for promotional material for Grave of the Fireflies. I think somewhere I would actually like to see the 2012 dub and see what was changed for it. So in my opinion, it's an alright film and it deserves a thumbs up. Still good and still alright. So Comic Reviewer here, signing out and wishing you all a happy spring.